at 6 a.m. The temperature will be in the lower 40s. We'll certainly see some upper 30s and a few outlying areas by that time too. And then as we head towards the lunch hour, that's when you're going to go. Temperatures in the mid 50s, right around 56 degrees and looking at a high temperature, just a degree or two cooler from what we'll see today. So very similar conditions tomorrow from what we'll have today. Now, as we head later into the week, Wednesday and Thursday, this ridge that's building over the eastern half of the state is really going to be pumping in some warmer air and we'll get back into the 70s. But it is pretty quickly replaced by this trough that'll come overhead and stream in the Canadian air that'll settle in and bring us very cool temperatures as we head into this weekend. Then looking beyond this weekend, the 8 to 14 day outlook has a very strong probability that below average temperatures are going to stick around into the third week of November. So certainly changes are on the horizon. Soak in what you can now. Looking at plenty of sunshine today and tomorrow. Highs in the low or 60s. Wednesday and Thursday still dry. Plenty of sunshine, a high of 70 on Wednesday, up to 73 on Thursday. Then on Veterans Day, that'll be our next chance for rain. So I said minimal rain chances in the forecast for this week. That's when they come and they'll be widely scattered in nature. So not a washout for Friday. We'll take it down to 63 on Friday. And then by Saturday, starting the weekend, a high of 40 degrees by Sunday morning, starting off in the low to mid 20s. And we're looking at highs that very well might not make it out of the 30s. Melissa. Ooh.